Hey, my name is James Tran, and today we're going to look at how we can create cinema graphs in After Effects. First, we're going to grab our footage and bring it into After Effects, then we're going to drag it into the timeline. Next, I'm going to scrub through the clip, looking for which part of the image speaks to me the most. So I like how she closes her eyes here. I feel a sense of calmness, so I'm going to stick with this part of the image. After this, I'm going to duplicate the layer. This layer will act as the photographic part of the cinema graph, to keep the illusion of a photograph. To create the still frame, we're going to right click, go to time, and freeze frame. Next, we're going to grab the pen tool and create a mask around the subject. This will create the illusion of stillness within the image. To create the loop in the water, we're going to split our layer, Ctrl D to split and we're going to take the bottom layer of the footage and bring it to the end of the clip. We're going to set a keyframe at 100% at the end of the layer and go towards the beginning and set one at 0%. So to create the blink, we're going to duplicate our bottom layer, we're going to change it to yellow and rename it, then we're going to drag it back to the top. We're going to make a mask around the eyes to isolate the movement of the blink. Next, I'm going to trim the clip to a point where the eyes close. I'm going to duplicate the clip and add a time reverse layer to it. Next, I'm going to pre-compose the blink, duplicate the comp and drag it across. And that's it for the cinemagraph.